A PESKY WEED IS SPREADING THROUGH KANSAS MUCH FASTER THAN USUAL THIS YEAR. ZACH TECKLENBERG SHOWS US WHAT'S HELPING THISTLES GROW SO QUICKLY AND WHY THEY COULD BE A LONG-TERM PROBLEM. THEY MAY NOT LOOK LIKE IT. THEY'RE PRETTY FROM A DISTANCE. BUT MAKE NO MISTAKE, THISTLES ARE WEEDS. AND THIS YEAR ESPECIALLY, THEY'RE COVERING THE KANSAS COUNTRYSIDE. BASICALLY STARTS AT, at THE BOTTOM OF THE HILLSIDE. Runs all the way up to the top. The population boom is another problem we can blame on last summer's drought in the heartland. With the seed falling in the cracks from the drought, the wetness and the coolness, then then here we are. John Landon with you know, Douglas County Public it'll, Works it'll, says the phone calls keep pouring year, in. People reporting thistles on their neighbor's property. Farmers are worried because they can really hurt crop yields. While you are most likely to see thistles out in a field, they're more than just a farmer's problem. Wind carries away the seeds, which can end up right in your lawn. Landon says if you see a thistle, act fast because the weed multiplies quickly. You're going to save yourself problems down the road if you if you take care of two or three here this year and instead of 30 or 40 next year. Landon says the seeds can survive for years before sprouting, so you can expect to see Kansas thick in thistles for quite some time. In Lawrence, Zach Tecklenburg, 41 Action News. Well, now we know what to watch for. Landon says there are several ways to get rid of the thistles. You can use a chemical spray, you can mow them over or dig them out.